Hi right, everyone, my name is Yao Do. I'm Chris Egan. And we are here with a Cow TV at the movie special. Chris, hello. How are you? I'm doing pretty well, buddy. How are yeah, you? Good, good. I thought we could hold each other like, you know, like, like this? Frank on, you, know, just, you know, just like this. Like, that and stare at each other. Like that? You know what I noticed with this movie? A lot of really good looking Italian guys. <laughs> Where did you find these good looking Italian guys? What the hell? Um, well, I cast them myself. Right. Um, I went around, I got there early, um, and just, you know, just went around asking people, saying, hey, do you want to be in a movie? <laughs> you know, like, no, I don't know, the casting process. Very laid back. Uh, yeah, yeah. With a camera, just like, do you want to be on a camera? We're going to go shoot this thing. And, well, yeah, actually, anyway. from what I heard, the entire movie was shot on a handy cam. Uh, it was, it was. Um, there is a 3D version as well. Oh, which, really? Uh, I guess, like, internationally, you know, Australian guys are known to be quite good-looking and charming and, and, and white and whatnot. So, you know, if you had to compare an, an Australian guy to an Italian guy who's more, you know, darker and more passionate... Uh, and whatnot. You know, who, would you have a preference between an Australian guy and, a, and, and an Italian one? Oh, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> no. I mean, they both have their strong points, right? Uh, the, the Italians are very, very passionate people. Australia is a bit more, a bit more laid back. Mm -hmm. um, I think there'd be more Italian men that would be into this movie than Australian men. I, okay. ca I can't really see, like, the, you know, the footy kind of, like, Aussie. Oh, yeah. Going, yeah. Letters Go joy. Wallabies! Yeah, yeah. Go the Wallabies and beer, pie, I mean, yeah. Would you say that you're sort of a Romeo figure yourself? Yeah, well, I mean, people say to me all the time, uh, you know, like, how do you, how, why are you so romantic? And, and I say, yeah, you know, it's because I'm, I'm really into Shakespeare. Uh, right. No, I don't know any Shakespeare. I, I don't. Um, but, uh, no, it's, um, I, I, I mean, I think it's a, it's, it's a very different kind of romantic comedy and it's quirky and has funny characters and, you know, and I think... It's it's enjoyable. Now, do you think you'd be a good Juliet, actually? Yeah, I, like if I, you were, if you were to be a Juliet, I, what would your like? Would you be kind of like coy about it, or would you be like really aggressive? Like, how would you how would you do that? Uh, I think it'd be really intense. Like, just wear a really like dirty, crazy dress and like kind of like just look really weird and crazy and just yeah, just run right up to people and be like boo, you know? Like, <laughs> I don't know. That sounds I don't know. Yeah. That sounds appealing. Yeah. Now, in this movie, you portray an Englishman. Yes. Uh, and you know, you being Australian, I'm sure there is some tension there and some some confusion so I guess my question is uh, you know Englishmen are they the worst or the worstest people ever well, with Charlie I wanted it to be a combination of every sort of stereotypical British everything so I just took a bit of you know Hugh Grant Colin Firth you know Monty Python kind of I don't know just a bit of everything you know and, and I liked you know I'm, I kind of I'm fidgety myself so it was like it was a great chance to really just go 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 balls out on it, you know, okay. um, and it was fun, yeah. Crazy, you can go and, go and, go and balls, balls out. out. So hopefully balls you'll go balls out, out for yeah. quite a few more years, buddy. It's nice talking to you. <laughs> no, Thanks a lot. You too, man. Good? Okay. <laughs> <laughs>